Here are 8 Command Prompt CMD, commands that you can use to speed up and improve internet-related issues on your Windows computer. Type CMD in the search box and run Command Prompt as an administrator. One, Netch Interface TCP Set Global Auto Tuning Level. Type Netch Interface TCP Set Global Auto Tuning equals disabled. The primary purpose of the command is to disable the Windows Auto Tuning feature for TCP. This is beneficial in cases where network performance issues are observed, such as slow data transfers or intermittent connectivity problems. Disabling it will help overcome such slowdowns and improve overall network performance. 2. Reset TCP IP. Type Netch and IP Reset. The command clears any persistent TCP IP configuration issues, restoring the settings to their default state. This can be beneficial in cases where incorrect settings are causing internet slowdowns or disruptions. By resetting the TCP IP stack, you eliminate potential obstacles to smooth data transmission, contributing to improved network performance. 3. Traceroute. Type tracergoogle.com. Traceroute shows the route that packets take to reach a destination. It can help identify where network issues might be occurring, providing valuable insights for maintaining and optimizing network performance. It displays the sequence of routers or hops that the packets traverse through the network. It also displays the time it takes for each packet to travel from one hop to the next. This latency information can be useful for identifying delays or network segments with higher latency, contributing to performance analysis. 4. Ping Test. Type pingyoutube.com. The ping command is used to check the connectivity between your computer and a specific website or server. In this case, when you type pingyoutube.com and press enter, your computer sends a small data packet to the YouTube server, and the server responds. The time it takes for this round trip is measured in milliseconds, ms. The purpose of a ping test is to help you verify whether your computer can communicate with the specified server or website. 5. Check Network Configuration. IP Protocol Configuration Slash All. This command provides detailed information about your network configuration. Check for correct IP address, subnet mask, gateway, and DNS server settings. By running IP protocol configuration slash all, you can quickly review these details and ensure that your computer's network configuration is correct. It is a valuable tool for troubleshooting network issues and verifying that your computer is properly connected to the network and the internet. 6. Release and renew IP configuration. Type the following command and press enter. IP protocol configuration slash release. This command releases the current IP configuration, including the assigned IP address, subnet mask, and default gateway. This can be useful in scenarios where you want to request a fresh IP address. Renew the IP configuration from DHCP. After releasing the IP configuration, you can renew it by typing the following command and pressing enter. IP protocol configuration slash renew. Renewing the IP configuration can help address connectivity issues. If your computer is experiencing problems accessing the network or the internet, obtaining a new IP address may resolve the issue. 7. Reset Windsock. Type Netch Windsock Reset. This command resets the Windsock catalog, which may resolve network-related issues by resetting the Windsock catalog, you can potentially fix connectivity problems and improve the overall performance and stability of your internet connection. 8. Flush DNS. Type IP protocol configuration slash flushdns. This command clears the DNS resolver cache, clearing the DNS cache can resolve issues where the computer is trying to access a website using outdated or incorrect IP address information. It's particularly useful when you encounter DNS-related problems, such as difficulty connecting to certain websites or receiving DNS resolution errors.